for sure So cold, but we're always coming back for more Egos in this wicked game, it's all for sure Oh, I've got you Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I hope you guys are all doing well. And here I am showing you that I made pupusas. It's like a Salvadorian dish and they came out super delicious. Let me know if you guys have ever tried these. Um, and also on today's video, it is a extreme deep clean of my kitchen. This video is going to bring you a ton of motivation to get up and tackle something in your home. Here I'm showing you my oven. The last time I cleaned it, it was with baking soda and I thought I removed all the baking soda. But as I was using it, I kept seeing these uh, this dust. So I knew it was baking soda. So I need to go ahead and clean that very well putting on some gloves so that my hands don't dry out on me and i'll be using a brio pad to clean it out also with some dish soap and warm water i'm also putting away all the summer decor that i had here in the kitchen and it was very little but just putting that away so so that it's nice and clear and that way I can decorate for fall very soon let me know in the comments if you guys would like to see a fall decor video so that way i can make one for you guys and that is how dirty my oven looked now let's get ready to clean if this is the first time you guys are watching then i hope you guys subscribe and turn on the bell so that you don't miss any future videos and here i am scrubbing away removing everything that i can using the brio pad which honestly works wonders it literally only took just the brio pad for me to remove everything that i had to remove from the oven Look at the difference this is before and this is how it looks now all nice and clean now i'll be removing everything off my counters and i'll be using the comet spray to give everything a good wipe down Here I'll be putting some dishes in the dishwasher and the others I'll wash by hand and as I was giving this kitchen a good clean my kiddos were outside playing in the mud <laughs> and you're gonna see that in just a second here I recorded them and they were having fun so that's all that matters right? There you have it them having the best time of their life <laughs> and so back here in the kitchen i'll be continuing to wipe the counters down i won't be like organizing or decluttering the cabinets or anything like that because i just did that and if you guys haven't seen that video i will leave a link down below so that you guys can go check it out and get some organizing motivation
here I'm using some warm soapy water to remove the grease from my cabinets also just to wipe them down and get any fingerprints or any spills that they might have To clean my fridge, I am using this homemade stainless cleaner, which is one part water, one part vinegar, and a little bit of dish soap. And also above my fridge, I have all my cereals there because I had this ant problem going on, but I bought the venom that's like in these little boxes that a subscriber recommended. And after I put those, I have not seen any ants. So I'll be removing all that stuff from above the fridge and putting it back in the pantry so it doesn't look like that anymore. This window above my sink needed a good wipe down using Windex and then around it as well. I try my best to clean this window as best as I can because I live in a mobile home and it is very tall so I can't clean it from the outside. Also the screen is like built in so I can't remove it to get behind it. So like I said I just try my best to keep it as clean as I can but it still looks dirty. Here pulling out my stove so that I can get behind it and sweeping it and then mopping it also trying to get all that grease that gets stuck on the sides as you can see right here i am using the comet spray and giving it a good wipe down i recommend that you guys do this pull your fridge and your stove out every few months or whenever you get a chance or remember that way you guys can get all that grease that builds up and also anything that might go under them and just sweep it up and mop it up so it's also clean from the back to mop i'll be using this blue fabuloso that smells really good If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, I will leave it down here or in the description box. And you guys, if you do and you guys get motivated by me or clean an area or organize something, tag me on Instagram. Also, if you're watching my videos, tag me on Instagram so that I can see who's watching. And you guys right here, I was struggling so bad to pull my fridge out i always do it by myself and i could not figure out why it wasn't coming out so i just waited until my husband got home and these two cabinets were the only ones well drawers were the only ones that i had to organize and go through them because they had a ton of mail so that is what i'm doing here thinking about the way that you know me no one ever cared like you care for me you're such a bright star in the dark space And this is how they look now I got rid of all those papers and now time to clean my fridge my husband got home and pulled it out and there was like something sticky under it that wasn't letting me pull it out so I will sweep it and mop back there as well Now 
I'll be picking up this dining area. As you can see, there was puzzles on the table, giving everything a wipe down. Also removing the area rug under my dining table. After I removed it, I honestly liked how spacious it looked. So I left it like that and also those little flowers. I removed those and put the greenery that it had before. And you guys, if you would like to see that fall decorate with me, let me know if you guys would like to see it with a cleaning video in there as well or just a decorating video. So don't forget to let me know in the comments. I'm also wiping down the walls here and the cabinets as well and you're gonna see me cleaning the blinds and giving my chairs a good wipe down. Finishing up this dining area with sweeping and mopping and then just fixing my table back up. So tired of hearing all your stories About the drunk guys bragging and the glory You're such a nice guy when you're not just talking about yourself And the way of how you dwell, I get it oh, I'm so And there I am putting my area rug away I guess for now I like the way it looks So that is going in the closet And if I change my mind then I'll Put it back under there and I also need to sweep and mop. clean my sink I use this Clorox gel and also the Comet spray and you're gonna see it leaves it nice and clean and shiny so that is all the little summer pieces I had here so I'll be putting those away and that is gonna be it for this video guys this is how everything looks I hope you guys got motivated and enjoyed today's video don't forget if you did to hit that thumbs up for me or let me know in the comments if you're new don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell so that you don't miss any future videos take care guys and have a nice week I'll see you on my next one bye